Hey, hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Double D's Quickie Reviews, Hot Wheels Matchbox Edition. Dun, dun, dun. Now here, I, you know, I was going through some boxes. I found some more Hot Wheels and Matchboxes I haven't opened yet. And I thought, you know what? We'll just do a quickie video on it. Doo -doo. Now, there's nothing special about these cars. They're just something I found. And somehow or another, they caught my interest. We're not going to play around. We're just going to... There they are right there. We're just going to jump right into it. The first car... 95 Chevrolet Impala. Why'd I buy this one? Honestly, it just looks like a cool car. I can't think of any other reason I would have bought it. Yeah, there's really no... No reason at all. I just like the look of the car. Pop it open. later there we go oh it is so shiny it's actually kind of there we go look at that pretty car isn't it rolls pretty good it's a good little car yes i'm taking most of this stuff out of the boxes so that i can save room and you know i like to i like them Put them on a shelf or in a box somewhere. Now this one is the Mattel Dream Mobile. I liked it because it gave me a real Fallout. Whoops, sorry about that. A real Fallout um, future retro feeling. You know what I mean. Tuned. Doesn't look tuned, but you know maybe. Let's get them out. Here we go. Doesn't that just look cool? I think I have one in red as well somewhere. I just like this funky, funky look. How does it ride? It rides pretty good compared to the other sizes of the other car. It's about the same size. I like it. I'll try to get this thing back a bit because there's a few cars here to get out. What do you think? Modern design, retro, old, old, Futuramo, look. Okay, the next one is a 94 Pontiac Firebird, because what kid didn't want a freaking Pontiac Firebird growing up? When I was younger, I used to collect a lot of muscle cars like this, and I'd put them across the deck front of my car, with a little Velcro on the bottom, because I knew I'd never own one, and I never will. I have a friend at work, well, used to work where I do now, Hey, Connor. And he had one of these, and he loved it until I got wrecked, and then he was just depressed. But he bought one of these, and I was like, hey, I like that car, too, so I bought one. Oop, trash can. Yeah, look at that. Oh, it's got the little Firebird symbol on the front. I don't think you can see that. And it just, it's a really reminiscent of the, um, uh, Night Rider car, but it just looks cool. Too, too fast, too. Next car, boom. 76 Honda CVCC. It's a matchbox, you know, not a help you, but you know. I can't remember why I got this. I think it's because my mom uh, used to have a, a Pinto, a Ford Pinto. This isn't a Ford, this is a Honda, but it was a similar look. She called it Putt Putt. Love that car. But I always like the sort of older looking cars. What's that say on the back there? My 76 toy. Okay. But it just looks cool. Now I do have the Mr. Bean car. I don't plan on opening it today because, well, I have one opened upstairs already and I. I have one also on card because I love Mr. Bean. Now, this is another one I got, Matchboxes. Now, there's a really funny uh, demotivational picture of one of these. It's about to go through a tunnel, and you know it's not going to make it in. Hey, 
convertible is like really tailgating it and it's just a, wait for it wait for it but then i saw this and it's like it's a truck with porta potties on it i mean who could say no to that it's called the poop king i mean it's just fun and that's what this is all about fun Boop. oh the porta potties come off so if you want to put them somewhere there's the inside it's a poop with a crown and i don't know what that's supposed to be but it fits right there anybody's ever to, ever had to use one of these blue torture machines you know what i mean Ooh, that's right smoothly too has a i think maybe that's supposed to be like a spare tire i'm not sure 2018 but the poop king tell me that's not cool okay now we got to my butter Okay, I got some Batmobiles. Everybody knows I'm a sucker for Batmobiles. Normally, I'd give them their own video, but I don't have that many, and I don't want to wait. So, let's get them open. Now, this is the Dark Knight Batmobile from Hot Wheel. I don't usually buy. I don't even know why I bought this, because I don't usually like them when they're not black. Giggity. But they, this one, figured, what the heck? It's only 99 cents. For the price increase and like you know i don't know maybe it goes in the dark i do yeah but it's cool enough it's a batmobile everybody knows that's one of my weaknesses yeah yeah the next one is oh wait a minute it's the same car what the heck only in looks like dark blue but i think it's supposed to be black best for track Yeah, that's definitely a purple. Huh, I didn't even notice it was the same mold. Just different colors. I don't usually do that sort of thing. Then again, I was a few of these that I bought that are exact same car, and I didn't even realize I bought two of the same car. I just give the spare one to my grandson. One of them. That's cool. Maybe I should just pick up every Batmobile I find that's a different color scheme. I don't know. I'm weird, wacky that way. Because it's cheap. And this one. This is the Batmobile. The, I think it's the Batman's the Batmobile. Does it say on the back? Uh, 2019. No, nope, it's not. Let's see. Does it tell you anything on the back? That's interesting. No. Still. I didn't have it. At least I don't think I did. Let's get it open. And, oh, that came off really easy. There's the last one, but it's definitely a Batmobile. Is there anything on the bottom? Oh, it says Batmobile. 2000. What's that say? 18? Yep. Move, get some Rupa suit. Move. I'll probably end up putting all the Batmobiles in one spot if I had enough room, but I don't, so, you know, into the box they go. These are the cars from this video. What do you think? What's your favorite car? Is it the Poop King? We know it's probably going to be the Poop King. I want to thank you all for watching this really quick video. Oh, only eight, oh, nine minutes. Uh -huh. It's a quickie video, yay! Hot Wheels edition, Matchbox edition. And, uh... Thank you all for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And y'all have a nice night. Double D. Out. Future past retro thingy bubber.